Postseason golf now underway with sectional tournaments this week. Sean, he had a nice warm up on Monday, setting a tournament record with a 309 in the rescheduled Jordan Mower Invitational. 12 schools gathering at Country Acres in Kaleida this morning. Top three teams and top four individuals advancing to districts on the par four first. Coldwater's Tyler Canny chipping on for his third. That's real good. He would tap in there for par. Liberty Benton's Elliot Logsdon putting for bogey. It breaks just in front of the hole, knocks it in from there. 83 for Logsdon. He's moving on. Jacob Holman of St. Mary's rounds out the group. He shot a 92 today. Still on the first, Van Wert's Jared Hernandez putting for bogey. Just the right speed there. Cards a five on the hole, 89 on the day. Eric Paris of OG putting for par. Little short here, he guards an 88 for the morning. Over to the par 311, Kenton's Britton Hensel. Not much left for par, and the senior takes care of that with an 86 for Britton. Shawnee's Ian Hastings knocks down his short putt as well. Also an 86 for Hastings, and finish up with Bath Spencer Stubbs putting for bogey. And he's got that one, an 84 for Stubbs. As for the team results, Shawnee, Kenton, and Bath are all moving on. And your individuals, Tyler Candy from Coldwater, Elliot Logsdon, Liberty Benton, Jaron Kunk also from Coldwater advancing.